How to compare two Excel files for duplicates? Comparing files for duplicates is something that you will need to do, especially when merging uh, two files or comparing two sets of data. For example, you have two customer databases from different months. You need to identify the duplicates so that no customer's information is replicated. So in this example, we have a list of names in one file and I have a list of names in another file. I want to compare and identify which are duplicates. So to, there are two ways of doing it. The first one is to use the VLOOKUP function. So we will type VLOOKUP. Now this function, what it does is it takes a lookup value, in this case, this name. And the second argument, you need to specify where it has to look up to. So we'll put a comma and go to the second one, the table array, which is in the second file. So go to the second file and select the range. Press Control Shift Down Arrow to go to the end of the column. Uh, comma. Next argument is the column index number. This uh, tells you what column you have to return the data from. In this case, there's only one column, so I'll type one. And the final argument is whether it is true, which would be an approximate match, or false, if I'm looking for an exact match. In this case, I will say false, because I want an exact match. And press Enter. And I can see that it has been able to find this name in the second sheet, so it has typed it here. Now, since this has already um, made the reference range constant with the dollar signs, I don't need to uh, modify this formula. And if you look at this, you can see it has the file name, sheet name, and then the exclamation mark and the range. So now I can just copy this down, control C, again, shift control to the end of the column. And press enter. Now you'll see that something has happened where I have error messages here. Now this happens because this particular name, Adelina, it has not been able to find in the uh, second sheet. That means this is not uh, there. So this is not a duplicate name. Now if I don't want that error to appear, I can uh, format this by saying, I can uh, enhance this formula by saying if error. And then I keep uh, this formula saying that if this formula returns an error, I just want to blank cell, which I indicate by double quotes, and say enter. Of course, we cannot see the effect now. We copy this down again. Press enter. And now you can see the error messages have been replaced by blank cells. So using this, I can find out which are duplicates. Now the second way of highlighting duplicates is to highlight the cells. So I will uh, delete this column. Now in this scenario, what I need to do is I need to copy the data from the second sheet. So I will go here, select this column, press Ctrl C, come back to the first file and press Ctrl V. Now I can use some uh, uh, feature called conditional formatting, which will highlight duplicates in these two columns. So first I need to select both the columns, go to conditional formatting, highlight cells rule, I say highlight duplicate values. So I can choose how I want it highlighted. I'm going to say I want a yellow fill and say OK. So now, again, when I go up to the top of the sheet, I can see that all the duplicates in both the columns have been highlighted. So I will know which names have been duplicated. So this is how to compare Excel files for duplicates. Please read the appended article for more information.